Three employees attacked by the same warthog at an exotic animal park in North Harris County. It's a story you saw first on 2 last night at 10 o'clock. Tonight, we're digging more into that park's history. Channel 2 investigator Joel Eisenbaum discovered several previous incidents and lawsuits. He's joining us live tonight in spring to reveal what he's uncovered about this. Joel? And Bill, if I could, I'd like to start with what I could not find. I could not find evidence of park goers, members of the public being injured by the exotic animals at this park. With that being said, there is a well-documented history of people who worked here and people who wanted to work here being injured by these animals. Still recovering from last Friday's warthog attack. It was kicking and bucking me around as if I was a rag dog. This young employee's encounter, it turns out, was not an isolated incident. Channel 2 Investigates has found two lawsuits dating back to animal attacks as early as 2009 at TGR Exotics Wildlife Park, a place open to the public. They were having, you know, young, inexperienced, untrained kids, basically, acting as zookeepers. That from the man who sued the park twice after a hyena attack and a bear cat attack. Both cases involving workers or prospective workers were settled out of court. Are you worried about your own safety? There's been Tuesday, we approached a current and by our own admission, new employee who politely declined to answer questions about her workplace. Her bosses haven't gotten back to us, but we checked. TGR Exotics USDA exhibitor's license is current, but it's unclear if that agency or any other is right now investigating this most recent attack here. I ended up concluding that there was a lack of reg regulation going on out there. Keep in mind, there are at least two sides to every story, and for the better part of two days, we've been trying to get the owners of this animal park to talk to us so far without success. We're live in spring tonight. I'm Joel Eisenbaum, KPRC Channel 2 News.